everybody. So it was a long time when I last post some video. This is because my little girl was born and I spent some time with my two girls. So I can say that my little girl is fine, is okay, everything is right. Uh, and I'm really, really proud on my two girls. Uh, so I'm really, really happy for my little girl, uh, but anyway, I need to start making new videos because I have uh, I have many ideas for many, many videos. So my first video will be based on conductive ink. So like you know, with my conductive ink you can make some heaters, for example, some ER heaters. One of those uh, ER heaters I have here. So this is some heating panel, I mean ER heating panel uh, in dimensions of uh, 50, uh, 50 centimeters by 12 centimeters. And yeah, conductive paint on aluminium. I mean, it's not directly under aluminium because I have some heating shield here. And on this heating shield, I have uh, this conductive ink, which creates really, really awesome ER heater. So it's really, really tiny and it's really, really good. So like you know, ER heaters creating these ER waves, uh, which these ER waves uh, hit the objects in the room. So right now I will connect this to my power supply, which is uh, DC power. Uh, and also uh, this heater is 100 watt heater. So right now I have the temperature of 28 degrees C and I will start right now. So in the cap, uh, in the couple of seconds, I get 91 degrees C. This is the surface temperature, and if I uh, have my hand like this, I can really, really good uh, feel the heat. Really, really awesome. Really nice almost 120 degrees C. One hundred twenty-one degrees C. One hundred thirty-one degrees C and this will be the maximum uh, temp temperature on the surface. So if you look on some uh, normal ER heaters, what is the surface temperature? You will see that the surface temperature of normal heaters will be between uh, 80 to 100 degrees C. Also, I will show you this base material, which is used in these heaters. It's something like this. And you can see also that you can make some uh, flexible uh, ear heaters. Let's see. With no problem at all. So if you want more heating power, you just add uh, several of these heaters, I mean heating panels, like this. Here is another one and you just connect like this one. And right now you will, I mean in this setup you will get a heater with 200 watts because 100 
what is each of these heaters. So this one is very very similar to this one, but uh, this one have some uh, how to say design changes. But yeah, it's the same like this one. One hundred thirty one degrees C. So this is like I said this heater is really very really nice and really really hot. Uh, but I also with this conductive ink you can make some integrated heaters, which means you can paint the wall and you will get some integrated ER heater. Uh, probably this will be in another video. Uh, for this purpose I will use this wall. Uh, this wall was my test wall for uh, capacity switches. But on the another side I will make some integrated ER heater. And I will see what I will get out from this one. So guys, that's it for now, uh, please see my next video, I will making some integrated heater on this wall, and yeah, that's it for now, we see us in the next video, and bye.